The game plan for today is my friend Parker's coming downtown and he's bringing one of his new custom built bikes. When he sells this bike, we want to have a bunch of art that goes along with the bike, showcasing the build, how it all came together. Now that the bike is up and running and it's actually street legal, we're gonna take it around to a couple beautiful spots. We're going to be shooting with the Pentax 645 on 120 film. Yeah, put her right here. Try and center it between these two kind of pillary things. All right, dude, tell me what this freaking thing is, dude. Dude, this is the Pentax 645N with a 75 millimeter Summicron. Yeah, Summicron. So it's a 75 millimeter, but it's on a medium format. So that's gonna be like a 30-ish millimeter. The trick is getting it to be razor sharp in focus because it's a old camera, so it's manual focus and it doesn't have a split prism. So literally, you just have to eyeball it. Take a peek through the eye hole and see what we just shot. Good Lord, man. Think that's gonna look good? That's gonna be so sick. Dude, yeah. I'm pretty amped. I think that's gonna be real pretty. So we're gonna go this way, and then there's a road that turns right just this way. And there's a really cool patch of light with a long streak of concrete behind it that I think is going to be beautiful on a super long lens. You want to roll the bike a little bit further this way, Park? I'm yeah. kind of losing the light. Nice. There's a little manhole right in the street. Put your tires straight over it. Not yet, though. Wait, wait till I'm there. Do you want uh, me to stop or keep going? No, keep going. I'm going to try and get it rolling. Sweet, I think we got it. Cars, do you want to use? Do you want to use one with graffiti or without? I think with graffiti. Was All right, go pick your favorite. Do you want it up there? Yeah, because that way I'll see the full train. Yeah. It'll look sick. That's perfect. We're making art. All right. So I'm gonna set this timer and then we'll have to move so our shadows aren't yeah. in it. Bro. Isn't that gonna look so pretty? The freaking uh, train car looks so good in that color. I mean, I've, this is all black and white anyway. <laughs> yeah, <right. Fuck. laughs> Shit, we should have brought some color. <laughs> it looks good. Yeah, I'm excited, man. I think that one's gonna look dope. I'm gonna try and see if I can't get some dust throwing up on it. Oh, I think that's gonna be pretty. Where to now? Because we want to burn basically this whole roll. Right. And we've got another 10 frames. And I brought my studio light that we can set up. So like we can shoot pitch black, like we can go put this into a parking garage. Yeah, because you're losing a lot of oil, man. I know. By the, by the time we've run it there and back, you might be dry. Once we finished photographing in the train yard, we loaded the bike back into the truck and drove into the city. Now that the sun was dropping below the horizon and we were losing all the light, we opted to shoot in an empty parking garage where we could utilize the overhead lights and put the camera on a tripod. But unfortunately, my camera battery died. So please enjoy this montage of all the photos from the parking garage.